Here we go again. I'm supposed to be asleep, but it ain't fucking happening right now. Um, you know how you try to look for something to go to sleep to, and then you just hear something different. So here we are, Fox 5, Washington, D.C. This is today, folks, from 11.02 a.m. Real Housewives of Potomac star Karen Huger, a.k.a. the Grand Dame of Potomac, got arrested. Okay, she crashed her Maserati. She was driving under the influence. How do we know this, Shree? Because she refused to take the breathalyzer. Why would you refuse to take a breathalyzer if you ain't drunk? Because drunk people would take the breathalyzer not realizing they fucking drunk. You know what I'm saying? Sober people would be like, yeah, I can take the breathalyzer because I ain't drunk. Okay? But here she go. I don't want to do the breathalyzer. Well, then you know you can take your bitch ass to jail. Go ahead now. She done wrecked the car. She crossed over a medium, crashed into a crosswalk sign and another sign. Another article said it was a couple of signs. Okay? And I'm glad they admitted that she was arrested and her license got taken away. Now, she says one of these citations wasn't uh, necessary. But, bitch, yes, it was because you could have hurt yourself and other people. So, you better thank the Lord. You better thank the Lord. Okay? That, um, you know, you're going through your shit. Now, here's my thing. Because she's saying that she was with some girlfriend. I know it ain't saying it here because I'm looking for it. Okay? Ain't no talking to no girlfriend going to make you feel like this for all of that. You got enough money. You can catch an Uber, bitch. Okay? You know you getting up in age or whatever. And I'm not trying to be ageist or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? But still, if you so rich... And you so emotional that you're going to wreck your motherfucking car because you don't know what the fuck going on. I suggest you catch an Uber because you can afford one of them too. All right. I know you rich people got some car service that'll hook your ass up. You could have called your husband to pick you up. Okay. Because what the fuck is emotional and, and, and to the point where you crashing cars? I don't get it. That sound like drunk. That don't sound like what the fuck she talking. But anyway, you can really tell I'm tired, all right? I might to upload these. We'll see. Peace.